Hello, I'm here. I'm one of Caterpillar's next-gen medium wheelers, and I'd like to talk to you about our ride control system. Caterpillar's ride control system on our next-gen loaders, as well as our M-Series, is a dual accumulator ride control system. It means you have a pre-charge both for an empty bucket as well as a full bucket. And you can choose to use that ride control, which will give you a more cushioned ride, a more comfortable ride. It'll also help with spillage around the job site because you are controlling that bucket linkage compared to the ground that you're traveling over. Easy to activate right here on the on the console. You've got uh, the ride control button. Just press it and it's illuminated as well as it gives you the signal that it, the auto mode is enabled. Now that's one way you can engage that. Another way is it is actually tied to our application profiles. And so under the profiles, you can see under a load and carry, it is automatic ride control mode as selected. Uh, under truck loading, uh, it is actually suggested to be off. In a truck loading application, you're going back to that pile multiple times. And when you go to the dig, your implements could feel a little bit soft if you've got that engaged. So suggest in a truck loading application that's turned off, when would you maybe want to change that activation speed? So let's say you are in a uh, load and carry and you want that activation speed to come on a little bit faster. You can see the defaults here are six miles per hour. You can adjust those. Uh, where do you adjust those? You go right into your machine um, menu settings, go down to machine, go to ride control, and now you've got adjustments both for uh, forward or reverse ride control activation speeds. And you can pull those down if you wanted to. That way, if you're in a load and carry application, that's coming on as quick as possible at helping you be as efficient and productive on your job site throughout the day.